Uh, well, most of the, what we're doing is doing brain imaging studies of people engaged in different kinds of spiritual practices, different kinds of spiritual experiences. And this is ranged from looking at meditation techniques like Buddhist meditation to prayer, Christian prayer, to uh, Sufi meditation, speaking in tongues, uh, just a whole variety of different kinds of practices and experiences that people have. And what we do is we use different kinds of functional brain imaging techniques to capture what's going on in their brain when they're engaged in these experiences, engaged in these practices, to see what parts of the brain seem to be turned on or turned off to give us a better sense of what's really happening within us when people feel religious, when people have a spiritual experience, how does that affect them, uh, and uh, and what, what are the differences between the different practices? Are, are all practices ultimately the same? Are they all fundamentally different? And we try to relate whatever changes that we see in the brain to what people actually do say that they experience. So we talk to them a lot about what do you feel, what do you think, and so forth, and try to get a sense as to whether the areas of the brain that underlie those particular cognitive and emotional elements and sensory elements are actually showing up in the scans themselves.